Hi there and hello. And yes, your eyes are not deceiving you. This is Fallout New Vegas in the year of our Lord 2021. What Lord? The Flan Spaghetti Monster, obviously. And if you don't worship his noodly goodness, well, I'm sorry, but there's nothing I can do to save you from pasta hell. Just <laughs> uh, jokes aside, though, I. Oh, I'm Southern tonight for some reason. Uh, my bad. Uh, but either way, this is Fallout New Vegas, my absolute favorite game. I just cannot shake this Southern. I should clarify, it is 2 a.m. I tried to be getting to sleep for the last three hours. Did not work. Little loopy. So just bear with me. I have not got a good night's sleep for this whole week. <laughs> uh, anywho, this is Fallout New Vegas. Came out around 2007. It's probably... Well, I've only played a little bit of 1 and 2, but this is my favorite Fallout game for sure. It's probably the best. People will debate that. It depends on what you look for in these games. For me, it hits all the right spots though. So let's just go ahead, get in here, start a new game. Which I don't actually, um... Oh, I forgot about this opening cinematic. Anyway, I don't actually know which uh, route we're going to go with the story because you, most of the quests and factions have like so many endings. <laughs> like if YouTube had been bigger when this came out, there would have been plenty of playthroughs of this, I'm sure. Maybe not. I guess early YouTube was, what, mostly horror? Yeah, I don't know, all the uh, videos from back then I can remember, I think there were a few Skyrim videos, maybe. Directed by Michael Bay. <laughs> huh. I do like this opening cinematic, though. War. War never changes. Uh. When it never did. fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic. Dedicated to mm -hmm. old world values of democracy Lord. and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world, and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam just barely against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House, and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. 
what seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink. Dig? You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. Is the guy on the right. It must seem like an 18 karat run of bad luck. <laughs> The guy on the right has absolutely no idea what the fuck is going on. He is freaked out in his fucking mind. Oh, I hope this is way up in the video. I'm allowed to say that. <laughs> oh, man. Fallout New Vegas. Roll credits. Already. Game over. I will say I'm probably not going to do a full series on this, but I might do a few episodes. I would absolutely love to do some of the DLC, especially <laughs> Old World Blues has some of my favorite moments. You're awake. How about that? Whoa, easy there, easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a sec? Get your bearings. Oh, that sounds nice. Just getting shot in the head, being put out cold for a couple of days. Sounds wonderful. Name Courier. Honestly, I've done a few runs where I just went with Courier. It's it's a nice name. But let's go ahead, uh We'll go with the YouTube channel name. Should be uh, totally great. Can't say it's what I'd have picked for you, but if that's your name. I'm Doc Mitchell. Welcome to Good Spirits. Now, Thanks, Doc. I hope you don't mind, but I had to go rooting around there in your noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework, but you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. How'd I do? Yeah, I... Well, wait. Because I could do a Legion run. I don't know. Actually, that might be fun. I don't know. The Legion is kind of like... they like lawful evil sort of deal, you know? And like, they're terrible, but it's like... I haven't done a Legion... I think I've only ever done one. Might be fun to do another. I'll just do the Mr. House run if we're... Um. Oh, take tall face. <laughs> oh man, some of these are something, huh? Oh, that last one actually. Oh well. Does it just cycle through preset section? Huh. <clears throat> well, that one's nice enough. I'll do it. Uh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh no. I forgot some of these hairstyles. Oh. That's a name? Okay. The Unsettler. Clean cut. Look like I'm ready for Boy Scouts. Pretty puff, Sarge. Buzz cut. Oh, 
Okay. I like how it always just has the little, like, hair string. I don't... Why? Huh. Half tempted just because that's funny to think... Ooh, that's not bad. <clears throat> that's a name. Yeah, I think I'm just going to go with this one. Why not? It's like the future. We can have colored hair. Stuff that matters. Okay. No sense keeping you in bed anymore. Let's see if we can get you on your feet. Certainly. Good. Why don't you walk down to the end of the Oh man, is this over by that? This may be all tutorial, honestly. Take it slow now. I forgot how slow the beginning of this game was. <laughs> I mean, it's a lot faster than like Fallout Three. Go ahead and give the uh, tester a try. We'll learn right quick if you get back all your faculty. All right. Uh, strength. I mean, you know, perception tells you, like, it tells you what they're good for. I know, I'm health resistance. Oh, endurance effects on art. I didn't know that. Huh. Okay. Charisma. Science. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> skill points are how you get more skills and get better at things, so, you know, having a stat effect those is, makes it a little pretty important. Uh, action points and regeneration. Uh, those are good if you're using vats a lot, which vats isn't bad in this game. All skills, critical hits, and miss up. Anyway, uh, you could probably tell what ones I'm going for. Like yours, I'm surprised them bullets didn't just turn right around and climb back into the gun. Well, we know your vitals. The luck's also a surprise tool that'll help us later. <laughs> what do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through a couple of questions? See if your dogs are still barking. Huh, I can't crouch. That's weird. All right. All right. I'm gonna say a word. I want you to say the first thing that comes to mind. Dog. Uh, cat. House. Uh, renovate. Night. Train. Bandit. Mm, Step. Torch. Mother. Paddle. Okay, now I got a few statements. I want you to tell me how much they sound like something you'd say. First one, conflict just ain't in my nature. <laughs> sure. I ain't given to relying on others for support. Nah. I'm always fixing to be the center of attention. Sure. I'm slow to embrace new ideas. Nah. I charge in to deal with my problems head on. E. Almost done here. What do you say you have a look at this? Tell me what you see. Uh, chemical okay. reaction. Oh. How about this one? Um. 
Sure, if we're talking about like that, everyone loves Raymond episode. Uh... <laughs> okay, this was done on purpose. Last one. Oh, it's the Forrest Gump shirt. Well, that's all she wrote. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you'd better just have a look at the results. See if it all seems right to you. Don't even know what that's supposed to mean. Uh, nah, let's put that in energy, science, speech. Uh, that's good. Act. Or should I? Should I boost lockpick? Or nah, this is good. This is fine. Huh. Before I turn you loose, I need one more thing from you. I got a form for you to fill out so I can get a sense of your medical history. Just a formality. Ain't like I expect to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head. Hmm. Still shorter than the intros for the other Fallout games, which I appreciate. Uh, you know what? I almost never take this one, so let's go for the Wild Wasteland. Hmm. Maybe, maybe. Sure. That's worth it. All right, I guess that about does it. Come with me, I'll see you out. Can I get close? Okay. Time to wander the wasteland as I was meant to, but naked. Except for my mandatory gray, gray cloth. Uh, I always knew it would end its way. Here, these are yours. Oh. Was all you had on you when you was brought in. I hope you don't mind, but I gave the note a look. I thought it might help me find a next of kin. But it was just something about a platinum chip. Wanna hear about that well, again? Well, if you're heading back out there, you ought to have this. They call it a pip boy. I grew up in one of them vaults they made before the war. We all got one. Ain't much use to me now, but you might want such a thing after what you've been through. I know what it's like having something taken from you. And put this on too, so the locals don't pick on you for lack and modesty. It was my wife's. I so think someone killed his wife, size. right? Is that what? Hardly wore I honestly don't know. Like, like I love this game, but I don't know all the lore. <laughs> Thanks for patching me up. Don't mention it. It's what I'm here for. You should talk to Sunny Smiles before you leave town. She can help you learn to fend for yourself in the desert. She'll like More to tutorial. be at the saloon. I reckon some of the other folks at the saloon might be able to help you out too. And the metal fella, Victor, who pulled you out of your grave. Anyway, you ever get hurt out there, you come right back. I'll fix you up. But try not to get killed anymore. No premises. Uh, so, I just tried doing this for the first time in another gameplay, I think, like another run, but, eh, nah. Oh, well, yeah, it was, ain't that a kick in the head? Because you got shot in the head. Ha! Uh, what's... Oh, it's high enough. Nice. Okay. Yep, weapons. Yep. Uh... Okay. Yep. I'll throw on the... This... And should be high enough repair. Yep, can grab that. Haha. <laughs> and I'm just gonna take that for safety. Actually, some drugs would help. Yeah, he's kind of uh, pretty okay if you just kind of loot his house, even though he gave you medical services, you didn't pay him. You know how it be. Doctors are just like that. I don't know. Oh, okay. Forgot about that.
<laughs> Loading a new game be like that. Oh, there's the metal. Okay. We good? Can I play? All right, I can play. Hello. Howdy, partner. Might I say you're looking fit as a fiddle? Thanks, Vector. Don't mention it. I'm always ready to lend a helping hand to a stranger in need. Hmm. Uh, this would be better if I was live streaming. Could get you guys to tell me what to ask. Um, how'd you find me? I was out for a stroll that night when I heard the commotion up the old bone orchard. Saw what looked like a bunch of bad eggs, so I laid low. Once they'd run off, I dug you up to see if you were still kicking. Turns out you were. So I hauled you off to the dock right quick. Do you know who they were? Can't say that I'm familiar with you rascals. Some of the fine folks in town might be able to help you out with that. All right. How'd you end up here, Vic? I moseyed into town, oh, 10, 15 years ago. Before that, I... Mm, I can't quite seem to recall. Odd. Anyway. It's a right peaceful town, and I reckon it's as fine a place to settle as any. I never did done seen a robot like you before. I'm a Securitron. Robco Security Model 26 to be. If you ever see any of my brothers, tell them Victor says howdy. Will do, Vic. Will do. Happy trails. Happy trails. <laughs> uh, Vic's a good guy. Or robot. I know. Okay, I. Th thank you. That that last one was the mailbox, so I. Sierra Madre Blues Trails Caravan Gun Runner. Okay, I think that's all of them. We shouldn't get any more. You must be the one Doc Mitchell was patching up. The way I heard it, I didn't think you'd be walking out of that office. I've got plenty of supplies for sale. Even got some weapon mods and special ammo. Well worth the caps if you ask me. If you're hurting for caps, I've also got boxes of surplus ammo in the miscellaneous section. They're not great, but you get what you pay for. Thanks, chat. Just show me what you got. Alright. Uh, useless. Not gonna be using that. Those you can have. Uh, how much? Don't get any ammo for that, but still probably worth keeping around. Uh, sell, sell, sell. Sell. Uh, don't actually know what this is for, so sell, sell. Okay. Uh, maybe we can buy some more ammo and... Oh! I didn't know he had weapon mods. Shit, you've been holding out on me, bud. What do we got? What do we got? Plaz, pistol, sight. Ooh. That's good later on. Alright, nothing I really need. Okay. Let's buy some of those. Let's double check what we need. 20 gauge. Mostly we want. Electronic cells. You got a. Oh, he's got a good laser pistol. Okay. Let's sell the shitty one, grab the good one. Yeah. Ooh, plasma pistol, that's better. Yeah, that's just straight up better. Might fire less often, but probably worth it. Okay. And we get 150 you caps. Out if you need anything else. Take it easy now. You too, chat. You too. Alright. That's good. So, how many shots we got? Okay. Enough that we don't want to be blowing things up. Uh, this is Easy Pete. He'll tell you about the world if you want to know. Cheyenne, stay. 
Don't worry. She won't bite unless I tell her to. Yeah, I guess there's a thing or two I could show you. Sounds like you need all the help you can get after what they done to you. Meet me outside, behind the saloon. Will do, Cheyenne, will do. Ah, uh, always wanted to be Cheyenne, was it, when I was a kid? Didn't figure that out until, uh, much, much later. Ooh, safe. <laughs> and I may not be uh, good enough to lockpick it, but I am certainly good enough to hack. So let's just, uh, klepto this real quick. Hostile. Farming, maybe? It's got a little more. Let's see. Could be the ling. Not really a good way to tell. And... Stating. I don't know. Oh. Wow. About a seven. <laughs> uh, that means actually we're really close. Um... Well, what are the other... <clears throat> Ooh. Okay. So normally, the thing you want to do is to cl click the power button and restart, but I'm going to risk it. Oh, oh, hell yeah. If I got that wrong, we would just be locked out of this, and I'd have to level up my lockpick. Alright, so disengage. Thank you. And let me just... Boop, boop. I'll take that, that, that. Uh, I can sell that. You didn't see nothing. Now, see the sarsaparilla bottles on the fence there? Take this and try to hit a couple of them. That's the right idea. Look down the sight. Try crouching down and staying still. Nice shot. Well, that's a start. But I don't reckon you came to me to learn to fight sarsaparilla bottles. Tell you what, I gotta go chase geckos away from our water supply anyway. Darn critters are attracted to it. Why don't you come along? Uh, sure. Follow me. It's just down to the southeast a short ways. All right, we'll just finish this little part of the tutorial and then we'll be on our way in the wasteland. Uh, this format rifle sucks. Let me just strength five, strength four. Oof. What did I end up putting my strength at? Four. Okay. Might need to raise that a bit by the end. But uh, we should be fine. All right. Oh wait, that's Sunny. That's Cheyenne. I always get them mixed up. Whoops. <laughs> oh, some of you may have been very confused when I, I met Sunny when I said Cheyenne earlier. Oh boy. <laughs> Max. Oh boy. I, I meant I wanted to be Sunny as a kid, not not the dog. <sighs> Honestly, it'd probably be easier though. Wouldn't have to worry about bills, you know. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So we'll end this. We'll do this tutorial and we'll wrap up there. And maybe I'll do a few more episodes in before I see if this one does good or not. Even because why not? I'm not getting to bed tonight. Insomnia. Oh, is that what they sound? Hear that up on the ridge behind me there? We got some geckos to clear out. Bunch of little monsters is what they are. Seems like Doc Mitchell treats more gecko bites than anything else. Let's see if we can get a little closer. If we move quietly, we can get the jump on them. More likely to hit something vital that way. Alright, let's go. Okay, you're on. Go give them hell. And that is why I have high luck. <laughs> See? You're getting the 
hang of it? There's two more wells that still need clearing. You want, you can come along. It'd be worth a few caps to me. Shouldn't take more than a couple minutes, especially with two of us. Come with me. Yeah, this is a tutorial, but it does give you uh, caps and XP, so it's pretty worth it. Huh. I'm also pretty good with guns, despite my... Well, I guess I, the DLC does give you some pretty good guns to start with. have another well to clear I think which this actually refills your hydration meter when you're in hardcore which duh oh well hey yep oh hey stop that Okay, I do not remember you. I may have been too slow the other times, I guess. Holy moly. If you had I've only done the tutorial dead, like twice be before this. Sure. I came up here to draw water, but here, you should have what I got. You look thirsty. Oh, wow. I thought I had to do the power gang quest to get accepted. Um, that is part of the reputation and karma system. Like you saw, I lost Kamer for stealing, and you get reputation for helping a faction. Now that was some good work. Even got a little exciting there at the end. Here's a little spending money for the trouble. One more thing I wanted to show you. Thought I might teach you about living off the land and making useful things for yourself. Interested? Nope. Okay, say no more. I'm heading back now. Hope I didn't miss anything good on the jukebox. Cheyenne would never forgive me. Hey, do me a favor. Trudy? She's the bartender up at the Prospector. Kind of the town mom. She likes to meet newcomers. She'd be cross with me if I didn't ask you to poke your head in and say hi. Alright. Well, that is where we are going to be wrapping it up for this episode. Uh, if you want to see more, you know, like, comment, subscribe, or just otherwise, let me know. You know, if it gets enough views or comments, I'll... Those that are upset. Spread your wings to rise from the ashes. <laughs>